there, wrestling fans, and welcome to another edition of CCW Superstars of the Ring, where we are knee-deep in the first rounds of our Ruler of the Ring tournament. Last week, Shooter McGee, with a little help from Brian Blitz, was victorious over the Russian assassin, and then Cecil Andrews took on the debuting Bryce Maddox, who proved that he was more than a match for Cecil Andrews, but the quick-thinking Brian Blitz slid in a little temptation into the ring, being his diamond-topped king. And before Bryce Maddox even truly knew what he was doing, he picked up the king and hit Cecil Andrews. Now, whatever personal feelings he had, the ref made the right call and disqualified the machine Bryce Maddox. So, Cecil Andrews advances to the next round. And this week... We have the final two matchups in the first round of the Ruler of the Ring Tournament. Right now, the man from Kodiak Island, Alaska, Cody Knight, is ready to take on the menace from Mensis, Cole Bohannon. So, let's go to ringside. Welcome back, CCW fans. This is uh, Superstars of the Ring and Continental Championship Wrestling's Ruler of the Ring Tournament. This is the third match of the first round. Cole Bohannon taking on Cody Knight. Absolutely. I'm very excited for this match. You know, Cody Knight is my favorite to go all the way. I can see him with a title here very soon. He's got to get a little bit more aggressive, though. He's a gentle giant right now. We need to see more tenacity from him for him to get a, any type of gold in CCW. Yes, Cody Knight uh, had an undefeated streak uh, not too long ago, and then he injured his knee, but he's 100% now, and his focus is to win this ruler of the ring. And wait a minute. Cody Knight just tossed Cole, uh, Cole Bohannon right over the top rope. I, I don't understand that. I guess that's that Tennessee flavor. I don't know. Is that how they do stuff in Tennessee? Oh, wait a hey, minute. Hey, wait a minute. Hey, Cole Bohannon. Hey. My name's Cole Bohannon. Hey, you need to get out of here, Cole. Save CCW. Go back to Tennessee. Don't come over here by me with that foolishness. Get in the ring. Hey. I didn't know they, they stack trash that high. Look how freaking big he is. Cody, come get him. Put me in. Hey, Cole, get back in the ring. Come on, man. Come on, Cole. Wow, hey, Cole Bohannon uh, just come down and just uh, sat down here at the broadcast table and Butch Price and Cole Bohannon trading words. And I tell you, boy, I thought something was fixing to go down between you two guys. Well, you know, he needs to learn his place. He just got here, and now he's acting like he owns the place. Coming up here with these right hands, these stiff right hands. I haven't seen him do any wrestling yet, but he wants to talk about how good he is. Well, I tell you what, I, I wouldn't cross Cole Bohannon. Uh, he's definitely a force to be reckoned with here in Continental Championship Wrestling. Yes, he, he is. He even attempted to uh, to retire rock and roll Chris Turner, but uh, to no avail. He sure did. He's got high ambitions, but uh, I don't think his talent is up to his mouth right now. Now, he's taking some cheap shots at Cody here. Foot directly across the throat, cutting off the wind supply. Cody's got to do something to get out of this situation. He's got to do something. And Cody and I are definitely taking some punishment from Cole Bohannon, and Cole Bohannon pandering to the fans. Fans not having it. There you go, Cole Bohannon driving the, the fistus is right to the side of the cranium. Absolutely. Luthes press and then goes for some more knuckle sandwiches. Wow, what a picnic. That's all he seems to do is street fight. I haven't seen a wrist lock, a hammer lock, or anything else. He's got to keep Cody off of his feet, though. There's no way he can contend with him if he doesn't keep him down on the ground. Stiff knee to the side of the face. Cody's trying to shake off the, co the cobwebs. We got uh, this Tennessee native going to the second rope. I don't know where he thinks he's going. Oh, and Cody Knight caught him as he came off that middle rope. Yeah, Cole Bohannon, man, driving the elbow Absolutely. right into the temple. Oh, what a big boot. That, that should be it. Wow, that should he, be it. He just cleaned a gum right off the bottom of his boot and gets a three count. Absolutely. Your victor, none other than Cody Knight, as he advances in the Rule of the Ring tournament. Cody Knight with the big boot picks up the victory and advances to the next round of the Ruler of the Ring Tournament. No word yet on who he will be facing in the next rounds of matchup. But folks, now it is time for our final match of the first rounds of the Ruler of the Ring Tournament. Former Southern States Champion, former World Champion, the New Breed Landon Cruz 
takes on Miles Blackwell. Miles Blackwell, of course, being cornered by that diamond-encrusted deviant Brian Blitz, who already has two charges advancing to the next round of the Ruler of the Ring tournament, that being Shooter McGee and Cecil Andrews. Will lightning strike thrice? Let's find out and go back to ringside. Take on Cody Knight. So this is going to be uh, interesting to see. Nonetheless, Brian Blitz at ringside uh, with one of his newest members uh, to the Diamond Exchange, this Miles Blackwell from Manchester, England. Absolutely. Landon has had plenty of problems with the exchange over the over the years, especially when he was going for the championship. They stopped him several times when the former champion uh, Daniel Anderson had the championship. Then he was able to overcome that obstacle, and he was cheated out of it at the last pay per view we had. So it's very devastating. So I know he got some get back to get back with this exchange. No doubt about Atlanta Cruz. Miles Blackwell tying up collar and elbow, showing of strength and leverage. Miles Blackwell dropping uh, Cruz back to the corner. Looking for a clean break. Miles Blackwell. Clean break. I wouldn't consider that to be clean. He shouldn't have touched the man. He should have just backed up off of him. We got a chant of USA going here. It seems that uh, Landon's getting the crowd behind him chanting USA. There we go again. Tying up collar and elbow. Aha! Landon Cruz now into a side headlock. Absolutely. Wrenching it in. Nice underarm and twist. Absolutely. Into a wrist lock. And there, Miles Blackwell, breaking the eyes of Cruz. That sure is. Now he's working over Cruz on the ropes here. The referee's got to get in there and break that up. He's not counting or doing anything. He's Ooh, allowing it to happen. Oh, my God, man. Punishing the kidneys of Landon Cruz. He's, oh, my goodness. Solar plex kick. What is he going to do here? Ooh, devastating DDT here. Devastating DDT. Landon Cruz in trouble now. Miles Blackwell bringing Landon Cruz back off the canvas. He's going to Irish whip him off. Reverse oh. Irish whip. Here we go. Miles Blackwell off the coast. Wow! What a beautiful drop kick by Landon Cruz. Showing the heart of a champion. You don't have to have a belt to be a champion. He's got the heart of a champion. He's going to show it here. A spectacular standing drop kick. What elevation. He's a supreme athlete. He's, he's, he's case positive of what happens when you go to the gym. When you eat like you're supposed to. When you get your proper vitamins and rest. Here we go again. Aha. Landon Cruz again showing that he is the top superstar. Absolutely. Back into a hammerlock. Technical wrestling. Side headlock float over. Excellent. Excellent. Textbook wrestling. Textbook wrestling. Now that's what the marquee says. Continental Championship Wrestling. Absolutely. So many guys get in here and try to win a wrestling match doing street fight tactics. You have to be able to wrestle in order to be anything that's considered to be a contender in CCW. Ooh, Miles Blackwell. Nice uh, kick right to the hamstrings. Absolutely. Blackwell with a snap mare and yeah. kicked him in the spine. Devastating kick. Blackwell now came, coming out of the corner with Cruz. Yes, he is. Cruz Ooh. gave him two feet to the face. Oh, wow. wow. Flying European arm, um, flying European uppercut. There, Brian Blitz now trying to uh, give some uh, advice to one Miles Blackwell. Landon Cruz uh, had the momentum going there. You can tell Blackwell's not used to this pace, though. This is a little bit faster for Blackwell. Maybe they don't run that fast where he's from. But here in the U.S., we're athletes over here. And another again, tie up. Oh, 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 boy. Here we go again with the irate. Al using the steel cables to his advantage. He sure is. And you got to know Brian Bliss is waiting for an opportunity to do something when the ref is not looking. Landon's got to get away from that corner. He has got to get away from over there. Now Miles Blackwell has got Cruz mm. in the corner. Bringing in those soup bones right into the back of the cranium. I'm telling you that's what it is. Irish whip back into the corner. Ah. Landon moves. Working over the back now, going to the shoulders. Momentum shifting now to Landon that's Cruz, it. and the fans are behind him. Hard Irish whip. Oh! He cut him off at the pass. He cut him off at the pass, Landon build up all that momentum just to end up on the ground. Miles Blackwell now cleaning his boots off on Landon Cruz. He sure is. 
Oh boy, that's not a good position to be in. That looks like a modified type of coat, uh, camel clutch there, doesn't it? It's just insult to injury, as far as I'm concerned. And there we go. Mm. Oh my goodness, landing. He's trying to reach for that rope there. Yep, Landon Cruz trying to get over to grab the rope for Does a break. Does he have it? I can't see it from here. Did he make that grab? Able to get the break, and now the... Wait a minute. There's Brian Blitz. Something's got to be done about this guy. Every time he gets a chance to take a cheap shot, he takes it. It's never a fair fight. No doubt the mastermind of the Diamond Exchange. And, of course, uh, we miss our Donnie Harris... Uh, our ring announcer, he's still uh, recuperating and rehabbing after his automobile accident he had uh, several weeks ago. Absolutely. We just thank God that he's still alive after that devastating car accident. Oh, my God, man. It's all elementary now. Landon's got to build some type of momentum here. He can't win laying on his back. He's got to do something. And what an arrogant cover by this one Miles Blackwell. And Brian Blitz is complaining to the referee about the... Slow count, but and wow, Ooh. look at this landing cruise yes, now. Sir. He's on fire, he's bringing some wood, that's for sure. He's charging up, he comes up, Ooh. spinning heel kick, not the taste straight out of landing cruise's mouth. Wow, man, this Miles Blackwell sure and showing why uh, Brian Blitz bought him in as a member of the Diamond Exchange. You know, you, you could like the guy and not like him, but he's definitely getting the job done against a former champion. We have to give the newcomer a lot of respect. Wow. This Brian Blitz it's definitely uh, found a diamond in the rough with this Miles Blackwell, but wait a minute. Landon Cruz now. Coming back with a fury. He sure is. Miles Blackwell reeling. Irish rip over into the corner. Landon Cruz comes in. He floats over. Woo! Yes, sir. He's Lewis. climbing. He's, He's climbing. climbing. He's going to the top rope. Cross body. That should wow. be it. If he can get the cover here, that should be it. What a beautiful flying cross body by Landon Cruz. He's not going for the cover. It's personal this time. He's got more damage to give. It's looking like he's going for Wait it. Wait a minute. Brian Blitz up on the apron. He knew if he had hit that cruise control, it would have been completely over. And Miles Blackwell comes in. Oh, my God. Cruz ducks out of the way. Brian Blitz gets Schoolboy. the worst of it. Schoolboy. Landon Cruz victorious. Your victor, Landon Cruz. Landon Cruz getting the victory roll up with a little help. From Brian Blitz, the new breed continues on his quest to win the World Heavyweight Championship for a third time. Meanwhile, for the time being, Miles Blackwell is going to have to sit on the sidelines and drink his tea. Plus, more bad news for the Diamond Exchange. I have just been informed in the first matchup in the second rounds of the Ruler of the Ring Tournament, tag team partner Cecil Andrews and Shooter McGee have been pitted against each other. And the most pertinent question will be, who will Brian Blitz corner in that matchup? That, plus many more matches in the second round of the Ruler of the Ring Tournament, coming to you next week on CCW Superstars of the Ring. For everyone in Continental Championship Wrestling, I've been your ringside pitchman, Donnie Harris Jr. And next week, we'll see you at ringside.